Oh, guys, this is this is knocking me sick a little. It's not real, Monica. It's not real. Oh, oh, oh it's like a zit cut. Oh, no, it's still coming. Pull back the corneal flap. This is the nailed it. Shape with a oh. laser. Hey, guys, welcome to another episode of Dr. Bungle Hall's extraordinarily educational, awesome thing. Dr. Bungle Hall is amazing. All right, we're doing in ground toenail shit today. I'm sure it's going to be just great. It's going to go swimmingly. I I want to do the, the the LASIK eye surgery as well as, as well. Jesus. Hello and welcome to Surgery Squad's virtual Dr. ingrown Jeff. toenail removal. Shut I'm up, Dr. Minute. Jeff. I haven't finished and I'll talking. I'm guiding though. you through this procedure today. An ingrown toenail happens Ooh. when the edge of the toenail grows down and into the flesh of the toe. Yeah, it does. When this occurs, there is usually looking. a moderate yeah, amount yeah, whatever, of pain, Dr. Jeff. redness, and swelling around the toenail. Let's uh, anesthesia this Our motherfucker. Is ready. Oh. So let's begin by disinfecting the I toe. I have an ingrown toenail. I've always had an ingrown toenail, but it does not look like that. Mine's just a little, a little ingrown, and I just like cut my big toe in the middle like into a v i cut out a v so it grows in rather than at least i didn't have to have this surgery you know click and drag to, uh, okay i'll just do it everywhere except in the places you want why the fuck not so yeah i'm gonna do this one and i'm gonna do the laser eye surgery because these are surgeries that i could possibly have in the future and i feel as though i should know more about them plus you know this channel is all about education, educating the youth, educating the elderly. I just love to educate, guys. All right. Now we look super sexy with our super hairy toes. <laughs> now, we need to numb the toe with a local anesthetic. We'll oh, have no. to inject the anesthetic in several locations around the toe. Needle. I'm not too bad with needles. Oh, it's the noise that it makes. It's like squishy. Oh, and it's bleeding. Ugh. Quick, quick, in the tip. Just the tip. Quick. Nailed it. Nailing Great. the tip. Now we'll wait a few minutes for the toe to get numb. Really? I don't have time for this. Alpha. Oh, Soft call poor music there in the background. Elevator music. Now that our patient's toe is numb, place the special tourniquet around the toe. This will help reduce the amount of blood coming from the wound. Once you've done that, we can move on to removing the ingrown the portion wound? of the toenail. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean, wound? There's no wound. Are we going to chop this guy's toe off or something? The, just the tip? First, carefully slide one blade of the nail anvil under the affected nail. What? Dude, the nail anvil? Are you shitting me? Under the... No, it doesn't go under the... It doesn't. It won't fit. It will not We're fit. going to go down the nail until we feel a little bit of resistance. Our patient's going to feel some pressure as we cut away the ingrown nail. No shit! Are you... No! No, they're not going to cut all the way down, are they? No. Oh, it was horrible, guys! <laughs> what are they doing? No! Oh, do it again. Oh, that's horrible. It's crunching. It's like he's got athlete's foot. Oh, he's always oh, under the bottom of the toenail. Oh, no. That's horrible. That is gross. That is just, no. I don't want to press it. Oh. Great. Take the forceps and carefully remove the ingrown nail. I honestly did not know that this was going to be this gross. Oh, oh did you see the string? Kind of messy in there. Oh, Let's God. Clean up that blood. Really? Is it messy, Jeff? Dr. Jeff? Oh, bungle hole was not See that small bit of pale yellow substance Ew. right there? Yes. It looks like the patient has a bit of infection in the toe. Firmly squeeze the edge of the toe oh, and get no. as much of that infection out as you can. It's going to be like a zit in it. Oh, guys. This is, this is knocking me sick a little. It's not real, Monica. It's not real. Oh, oh, oh it's like a zit cut. Oh, no, it's still coming Oh, oh. That toe is starting to look much better, but we're not done yet. Next, we're going to apply some phenyl acid to the wound. So what? This will help ensure that the problem of ingrowth will not reoccur in this toe. When you're done inserting the acid, oh. I'll remove the tourniquet and we'll finish what up. What are you doing, Dr. Jeff? What? Oh, shit, sorry. Why are you making me do this? 
finish by applying some antibiotic ointment on a sterile gauze pad. And Dr. Jeff's antibiotic cream. I don't. Let's just finish this. Place it against it's the nasty. toe and wrap it in a gauze bandage. Wrap it. Wrap it. Do it. Nailing it. Toe nailing it. <laughs> Fantastic job. Ingrown toe nailing it. Fuck yeah. Oh, should have did it again. Since there was obvious infection, our patient will be sent home with a prescription. Yeah, we, we did it. We did it. That's it. That's dead. We'll also need to tell so our patient that that's to keep over. the wound dry. Clean the wound regularly and replace the bandage two to three times a day. While our patient's wound isn't likely to regrow, his condition is likely to return if he doesn't take care of his feet. This includes wearing proper fitting shoes, properly trimming his toenails, and keeping his feet clean and dry. Did you see his toenail? And that's how we remove an ingrown toenail. Oh, the puss part. <sighs> so yeah, I've had an ingrown toenail since I was a kid. It was because I didn't wear shoes that fit me my mom got pissed off with buying shoes for me when i was a kid growing up in school and i can't afford new shoes every year you just have to fucking make do so i did and i ended up with an ingrown toenail on both of my toes big toes it's great it's so great so LASIK eye surgery is something Welcome i might to get surgery one squad. virtual lasik eye surgery let's learn about it i am dr Susie. What the fuck is Dr. Jeff, Susie? A LASIK eye procedure today. I have a cat called Susie. LASIK I don't trust eye you surgery already. reshapes the cornea to provide improved focusing power Susie's and reduce a, a patient's need for glasses or contact <laughs> lenses. LASIK is performed with a special laser that's used to change the shape of the cornea. The part of the laser eye that controls and in focuses the sooty. entry of light. Oh, By doing so, sweet. we can focus the light so that the patient's <sighs> vision is improved. You're boring me, Susie. You're boring me. Our patient's... Are we want to make this procedure as pain-free as possible, her eyes. so we'll use drops to numb the eye. Can you place a few drops into her eyes? Sure. Even with the numbing drops, it's possible that the patient can feel pressure and mild discomfort, but they do help with most or all the pain. We'll use My a friend. device called a speculum to hold the eyelid open wide. Oh, so that what do you use in your vagina when you go the to the gynecologist? I'm pretty sure it is. They have speculums for your eyes. That's what they have at the, 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 the vagina office. <laughs> I should go to the vagina office and do a trip. But, yeah, my friend had laser eye surgery and I asked her what it was like. I was like, is it painful? She says, no. But you can smell it when they turn the laser on. She, she says it's like burning hair or burning toenails. Oh, no, thank you. I think I'd freak out if that happened to me. I think I'll stick with if contacts. The was allowed Ooh. to blink. We what? might cut or burn the wrong area. At this point, we'll also mark the cornea with a water-soluble ink to guide replacement of the flap. Flaps. <laughs> now we Piss place flap. a suction ring so, over the eye. What? So hang on. You can't blink. What do you do when you get dry eye? Do they have eye drops to lubricate? God damn it, Monica, would you be careful? I don't, I just, I'm trying to learn. The ring sucks the cornea upward, making Ooh. it easier to cut. What? The patient's vision will likely dim and blur Whoa. while the suction ring is attached. What? For this next step, we're Warning. going to slice open a flap on the cornea. To make the corneal flap, we use a mechanical microkeratome. This is a fancy name for a blade device that's attached to the suction ring. Oh, it's like we a slide it across and it cuts the top 20% of the cornea. Here we go. Slide the microkeratome along the track to create a thin Here flap in the cornea. Bitch, I'm about to chop someone's eyeball in half. You, here we go. All right, are we ready for this? Oh, God, the suction. Ugh. Oh, <laughs> I did it really quick. I, oh, why, why, With the why? corneal flap cut, we remove the microkeratome and I'm suction so ring and then peel back the corneal flap Especially to expose the to middle eyes. part of the cornea. Ugh, all of these words. It's just so gross. Pull back the corneal flap. This is the Nailed it. shape with the oh. laser. The computer-controlled laser is positioned what? over the eye. By analyzing our patient's data, we've pre-programmed the laser to tell it how much corneal tissue to remove. Ew. A flip of the switch to fire up the laser, and the reshaping process is underway. Pulses from oh. the laser will correct the shape of the cornea in less than 60 seconds. The laser makes a slight clicking sound, and you might notice a faint smell similar of burning hair. And that's it. Please fold the corneal flap back into the original position, making sure our ink guides match up. 
What? That was it? Sixty seconds? Nicely done. Nailed While it, you me. were working, I went ahead and took care of the other eye. We will observe our patient for several eye, minutes to assure the cornea is bond correctly. The cornea is quite amazing in this respect. It will be bonded back to each eye in moments. What? The cornea is still vulnerable and could dislodge if the patient isn't careful. That's why we put a clear protective shield over each eye. This keeps the patient from bumping or rubbing her eyes. The patient will notice the improved vision immediately or as soon as the numbing drops wear off. She may now be driven home as she won't be able to drive this for a day. Fucking or two. witchcraft. She'll come back within the next 48 hours um, so we can pirate, remove the eyes. Piracy. Test witchcraft her and piracy. And examine her eyes to make sure everything is healing up nicely. And there you have it, another successful surgery. You can see more of my superior surgical techniques superior. and my other procedures here on surgerysquad.com. Is that a baby coming out of a vagina? Let's just move on from that then, I guess. <laughs> All right, guys. Oh, bloody screaming baby. Lovely. All right. That was... Uh, I do want laser eye surgery, but I've always been worried about it. But they slice your eye open so they can blast a laser into it. And then the eye magically heals. I'm not paying... What is it? It's like a fucking grand per eye. I don't have that kind of money to drop on my eyeballs. Anyway, guys, that's it. I think I want to do more of these every now and again. I don't know. Do you want me to do them weekly? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, whatever. If you enjoyed this video or if you found it educational, I did. Um, I didn't know it was going to be so quick. 60 seconds with the laser. Huh. Maybe I will get a laser eye surgery one day for, uh, you know, win the lottery or something. Or someone gives me the money. Or I win a competition. Back alley surgery. Something like that. Something cheap, you know. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Leave a comment. You know I appreciate it. Share, like, subscribe. And share, like, subscribe, comment, and favorite. You cannot favorite. But I'll see you guys in the next episode. Okay? Take care of yourself now. Bye. She also has an eye for Mr. Jettison. Which is so obvious that I'm embarrassed for her. Oh my god. Has she seen his wishing tree? <laughs> what are they gonna do? Oh, look, little curly tails. Oh, one of them laughed. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs>